Okay, we've previously learned how to measure a diameter. Now we're going to go ahead and establish a zero to the center line of one of those diameters. So then we have the ability to measure center to center. Um, it's a very common call out in a lot of prints. Uh, many parts have this as a critical measurement. So I'll show you how to do that now. First, we'll establish our, our datum diameter, the, datum, the diameter where we're going to establish a zero to our center line. So we're going to drive into our part. Again, slightly off center and engage the probe, sweeping the probe through the bottom, through the low point, driving up to the top, engaging the probe, and sweeping back through the high point, giving us a center line and a, a diameter and a center line. At this point, we will then hit the zero button. In reference one, we have now reestablished the zero position to the center line of this diameter. Now I can measure another diameter or any other location and my measurement, my center measurement, is going to be relative to the center of this diameter. So if we drive to another diameter, say this one, I'll engage the probe, sweep through the bottom, sweep through the top, and you'll see as we do that, engaging my probe and sweeping through the bottom of the diameter and engaging my probe and sweeping through the top of my diameter. Again, as we pass through the low points and the high points, once we make that second contact through the high point, the gauge freezes and it locks on our ID. So we have an ID measurement of 1.25865 and 3.876 is actually our center to center dimension. We could do that to any diameter. If I come over here, engage my probe, sweep through the bottom, and sweep through the top, we then have an ID measurement, 785 thousandths. And then we have a center to center dimension from our large diameter that we established the zero to, to the center line of this diameter that we have currently measured of 1.712 our center to center dimension. A very common call out. Um, it's typically a critical measurement on many prints that have diameters on them. Um, so that is going to be how you'll do that.